We're going home to my, the Emerald Isle. A fan has made a documentary about my life and my beautiful country of Ireland. Here we go. Lovely. Rosie T. Hi, I'm Ava Nocton. I'm 13 and I'm from Galway in Ireland. And I'm Ireland's biggest One Direction fan. I won a competition on an Irish radio station 2FM to meet Niles, principal, family and friends. We're at a school in Mullingar, so let's go inside and meet his principal. <laughs> I'm here in Niall's old classroom. I can't believe this is where he actually sat. Beside me is his old principal, Mr O'Mara. Mr O'Mara, was he a good student? He was an excellent student. He loved school, loved fun, a lovely guy. But it is hard to believe that he sat in this classroom that you are actually sitting in now. Be honest, did he ever get in any trouble? I honestly say that genuinely, Niall was never in trouble here in Colossia Are you sure? Never ever in detention? Well, maybe in odd detention. I'm here at Niall's local record shop where he would have bought records as a young boy. And now look. And I'm here to meet his man and his gran. Great to meet you, Niall's man, Maura and gran, Margaret. So, Maura, has family life changed for you since Niall became so famous? I suppose it has in that uh, we're thrown into the limelight now, thanks to Niall. But here at home in Mullingar, we're getting on with our lives. So what do you do with Niall when he comes home? Well, we try and have some family private time. It's not always easy, or maybe sneak him out for a meal somewhere, but um, it's mostly just to have spend time with Niall. So what do you think he'd be doing if he wasn't famous? Well, when he, when he was leaving school, he wanted to be a sound engineer, so he wanted to go to college to study sound engineering. So, Margaret, being his gran, do you think he's still as cute as he was since he was a baby? Yes, he is still as cute to me anyway. He was always a lovely child coming out to see me. And how proud are you of Niall? Well, I am so proud of him. I mean, he's kind of had a, a long take on all this now, three years, you know, and I am so proud of him. I'm delighted for him. So I'm here in Niall's local hotel with Niall's dad, Bobby, Hi. and Niall's brother, Greg. When Niall comes home, do you do anything in particular? No, he just chills out, same as he always did. He likes to lie on the couch, watch the football, the same as he does even when he's f finished his work. Do you think Niall is like you in any way? People say he has my eyes. Uh, other than that, he's very jovial. I like to think he might have got that from, from, from myself. Like, you know, he's he's good character, like, you know, he, good turn of phrase. You got to be in his last music video, Story of My Life. What was it like? Well, it was weird. Never been in a film before like that, but it was good. It was good crack to film it. It was strange. It was odd to see an actual music video being shot. It was enjoyable. I really enjoyed it. I had a really nice day meeting Nald's family and principal. But from now, bye. 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 Yes, everybody. <laughs> Ireland. Ireland is. Oh, go again. Yeah, that's it. Love Ireland. Gotta love Ireland. You do love Ireland. Good to see the family there. Haven't seen them in a while. Slowly but surely, we will take over the world, I promise. Mm.